Hey everyone, in this video I'll show you how to create a professional portfolio website using Cursor AI, all with simple prompts, no manual coding required. Whether you're a data engineer, full stack developer, or Salesforce expert, this method works for all the roles. Let's dive in. Before we start building our portfolio, let's talk about GitHub pages. It's one of the simplest and most effective ways to host websites for free. Whether it's a personal portfolio, a blog, or even a project documentation. GitHub pages allow you to deploy a website directly from a Git repository without needing a separate server. All you need is a GitHub account and a little creativity. Before we start building, we'll need a GitHub account. GitHub is the platform we'll use to store our website files and host the portfolio using GitHub pages. If you already have a GitHub account, go ahead and sign in. If not, head over to github.com and sign up. I already have an account. Let me sign in. Once you're logged in, you'll see your GitHub dashboard. This is your GitHub dashboard. This is where we'll create our repositories to store our website files. Now that we have our GitHub account ready, Let's move on setting up our repository. A repository is where all our website files will be stored and managed. Think of it as the home for your portfolio project. Creating a repository is simple. Let's do it together. Click on new repository. Give it a name. Keep the repository public. Check the box in initialize this repository to have the readme file. Click on create repository. That's it. Your repository is now set up and ready to go. Cursor AI is a cutting edge AI powered IDE designed to make coding faster and smarter. It can help us generate complete websites, automate repetitive coding tasks, and optimize workflows, all with just simple prompts. Whether you're a developer, a data engineer, or designer, Cursor AI accelerates your workflow, removes the need for manual coding, helps you build modern projects quickly. Now let's download and install Cursor AI. I already have Cursor AI installed on my machine, but if you haven't done yet, make sure to download and install it. Once installed, you have to sign in using GitHub account. I've already done it. Let me open a new terminal. Navigate to the folder where I want to clone my repository. I'll open that folder. We are now ready to start generating the portfolio website using AI. It's time to start building a portfolio website. Instead of writing everything from scratch, we'll use Cursor AI to generate our index.html and styles.css. With Cursor AI, we can generate clean, well-structured HTML files in seconds. Let's open AI Composer. Click on Command I. We'll now enter a structured prompt in Composer AI so that it generates our index.html and styles.css files. We have the sample prompt in the Medium article. The link to the Medium article will be in the description of this video. I'm simply copy pasting the prompt that's in the Medium article. We are prompting Cursor AI to generate index.html and the key sections of our portfolio are about me, skills, experience, project, and contact, while ensuring it's SEO friendly, accessible, and fully responsive for both desktop and mobile. I'm clicking enter. Look at that. Cursor AI is now generating a well-structured HTML file that serves as the backbone for our portfolio website. Let's now review the index.html file that Cursor AI has generated. 
This is perfect. It has all the sections we requested for. Let's accept the file and save it. Now that we have the basic structure of our portfolio, it's time to personalize it by adding content from our resume. Instead of manually editing the file, we'll use Cursor AI to update our index.html with our real-time experience, skills, and project. Let me copy-paste the content of my resume. I copy pasted the content from my resume. I'll now prompt Cursor AI to modify. This prompt is also available in the Medium article. I'm prompting it to modify the existing index.html, update the title, replace the About Me section, copy paste the content from your experiences and make it SEO friendly. I'm clicking on enter. It is now updating the index.html with all the relevant information from my resume. I have to accept these changes. If you look at it, right, all of my experiences are updated in the index.html. Let's now save it and deploy. We need to push our project file to remote repository. I'm opening a new terminal. git status I now pushed my changes to the remote repository it's time to publish it live using github pages this step will make sure your website is accessible to anyone on the internet so you can share it with recruiters colleagues and potential clients. We now have the latest index.html in the remote repository. To enable GitHub pages, click on settings, pages. The source should be deployed from a branch. Select the branch as main and the folder should be root. Save it. Once you save it, a GitHub action will be initiated. Once the GitHub action completes, we'll have the URL available down here. Let's wait for the GitHub action to complete. The GitHub action is complete and we have the URL to our GitHub pages here. Click on visit site. So this is the portfolio website you built. It has updated about me section, skills, experience, projects. Some sections are yet to be updated. Go back to your index.html, give cursor AI prompts to update it, push the changes to the remote repository, and simply refresh this page. And that's it. We have just built and deployed a professional AI-powered portfolio website using Cursor AI and GitHub Pages without manually writing a single line of code. Let's quickly recap what we did. We have set up a GitHub repository, installed Cursor AI, created and customized index.html by prompting Cursor AI, deployed our portfolio live with GitHub Pages. Don't stop here. Your profile is your personal brand. Use Cursor AI to further customize your website, making it truly unique and reflective of your style. Want to change the colors? Modify the layout? 
add a block section, just provide Cursor AI with updated prompts and let it do work for you. You can customize styles, add portfolio section, include a blog or case studies. This is your space to show your skills and personality. So be creative and make it truly yours. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit a notification bell. Also check out our Medium publication for more in-depth tutorials on AI, data engineering, analytics engineering and full stack development. Links are in the description. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.